Hi, this is Link vs. Roxas, and today I am going to review a demo for the PSP. Uh, the demo is called Kayakto Hitman Reborn Battle Arena. It is a fighting game based off the Hitman Reborn anime, uh, which is one of my personal favorite animes out there. Now, judging by... Th uh, I played this game before, uh, this um, demo, a few few times today, so um, I decided to... Uh, review it right now so uh before I say anything I think the storyline in it because uh I think the storyline is in the time where they're um stuck 10 years in the future uh all because of the uh 10 year bazooka incident with uh Lambo and uh Suna <clears throat> because um there's only two playable characters in there which I'm going to oop <laughs> my bad <laughs> uh play this now um, there's only, like, two playable characters, uh, let's see. There's Chrome Dokoro and Suna. Hey, it's me. How's it going? Hey, it's my camera. My shitty one, too. Oh, The game's made by Marvelous Entertainment, Inc. And this is the, uh, main screen here. Doesn't that look nice? That's only if you can see it. Press O. Okay. Ooh, gunshot. I think the uh, you know the music in it is pretty unique. I like it. Yeah, sounds pretty good. The music just sounds promising to you, but until you get to the gameplay, it just makes me want to kill someone. So in order for me to play this game, I actually have to put my handicap on high, literally, because. This is just a demo. The opponent is probably set to its highest. I mean, its highest difficulty. Or maybe it's mid. But still, the op your opponent, which is the computer, knows how to play the game better than you do. Literally, I can tell anyone who probably likes, who can pick up a fighting game in an instant, because I know a lot of people that can do that. They can pick fighting games up in an instant and just play them. They can just go, oh, new game? All right, pick it up. And they can beat the crap out of people who played the game for a long time, and they just played it for the first time ever. Okay, enough about that. There's only two characters, like I said, Chrome Dokoro and Suna. Well, I'm going to play as, um... I think I'm going to play as Suna. And, uh, I really don't want to have my opponent as Chrome, because she's a long-distance person, and she kind of cheats. Like, uh, you know... And... she re Her long-distance attacks remind me of Kill It, because he's, uh, so long-distance in, uh... Phil Caliber. So, I'm gonna have my opponent, Suna. Now, this is Suna in Dying Will, Hyper Dying Will uh, mode with the X Gloves version Vongolia Ring. So, let's play. Alright, I'm gonna pause this. Now, like I said, the music gives it off, it makes it sound good. Yeah, sounds good, huh? But, now, I'm going to tell about the controls. That's your attack button, right here and here. That's your, uh, grab button. Uh, now, I'm not sure about this button. I've been playing this game for a while. I keep thinking this is a grab button as well, because I remember pressing it once, and it almost tried to do a grapple. This is your activate your hyper strike mode, which is the, if you look down here, uh, I hope you can see it. You see that meter? Yeah, that's how. That's your hyper strike meter. Now, the only thing that I don't like about this game is just that there's no dashing. You're walking so slow. It's just movement is slow for even both the characters in this demo. Like I said, it's a demo. It's not the full game. It's only a. I would say this is a pre-review. So uh, let's continue. Like I'm doing, I'm button mashing in. I don't think you can see this. I'm trying to keep this close to the screen as possible.
Activating my special. It's starting to get easier now. Hmm. But I've been getting my ass kicked with handicap on lots of times when I first downloaded this. Um, so I'm guessing triangle is actually an attack button. Pretty much the attack buttons do the same. It's just regular attack, kick, punch, kick. There we go. There we go. Now I get it. X is punch, triangle's kick, and this is like a you know power attack. You know, kind of like you know, and it's like Tekken. There's regular kick, regular punch, power punch, power kick. I think that's, I think that's King of Fighters now. But let's get back to it. All right. Activating Hyper Wolf Frame Mode. <laughs> no, my, my technique. Now, I think I did one where you use the flames as an attack. But I'm telling you, um, as much as I like how the game style is, I pretty much don't like it at the moment. Because I've actually played many times, and I've been getting my ass whooped by the computer. I'm thinking that the CPU, you know, the computer is, like, fluctuating on levels. That's what I'm thinking. It's because... It's like, once it's retarded, next it's fucking smart as hell. I'm going to give this game, uh, this review, a preview of, um, I would say, 5 out of 10. Only because it's a demo, and because, pretty much, in order for me to win, I have to be on the highest level handicap. Um, for those who pre-ordered it, probably, you know, uh, or whoever's Japanese or English who loves the show like I do, I suggest waiting until more game vid uh, videos and gameplay of it comes out, and maybe soon, you know, it, when it's released, people release a uh, translation guide that also tra uh, helps you know how to play. Unless these people are smart and like Bleach Heat the Soul Five, uh, they have. It's mostly in English and Japanese, and they also come with a little menu that's in English as well. You know, a little piece of paper men. Um, uh, I would say brochure. It looks like a brochure to me. That's what I'm gonna say. And it's in English. Well, enough about that. I'm just gonna say, don't get this game uh, pre-ordered. I would say buy it whenever you feel like it. But um, I pretty much like it a bit. Uh, but earlier, before I did the review, I was playing it, and I was getting so pissed that the computer was so freaking smart. I was playing as Chrome Dokoro. She's actually pretty good because she's been cheap when I was using Suna against her as the computer. And um, I'm just telling you, it, all they need to do is just update the game, the game's uh, fighting engine. That's all they got to do, and that's it. Nope, oh, nope. I don't want to play into the game. Well, all I gotta say is um, thank you for watching, and um, I might be making more uh, review videos, but mainly more about actual games instead of demos. So, subscribe if you want. That's only if you want. So, thank you for watching.